of course, you're all about God's creation. Now, give us your insight with all these shark attacks and things going on on our east coast of North Carolina. What's the deal? What do you think? Yeah, I did a little bit of reading about it. You know, the, the shark, uh, we have a handful of attacks every year. It seems to be more this year than normal. Some of the experts are saying that the salinity levels in the ocean are a little bit higher because of the drought we've been in. It's also because it's been so warm, the ocean's a little warmer. And the bigger thing is all the bait fish uh, they're normally further out because of these factors are coming in closer to the shore and so the sharks are following the bait fish to eat them and so it's a, a lot of cases of mistaken identity um, and I think that's the major thing the other thing is that there are so many more people north than normal you know at the north and south Carolina beaches you know there's a lot of us so statistically being more people in the ocean there's gonna be more incidents with sharks uh, it's just a, a numbers game uh, but, you know, sharks are good animals. Like, I want to put that out there. Sharks are amazing. And if we get rid of sharks and start maliciously killing them for some, uh, you know, vendetta against them, it's going to disrupt the whole hierarchy of the ocean. I mean, we get most of our oxygen, believe it or not, from the ocean, from phytoplankton. So things that create sunlight, little algae and phytoplankton and things, lower level animals, you know, take care of that, eat that. And sharks kind of take care of it at the top. If we get rid of the predators, all the little guys are going to explode and it'll hurt us in the long run because they'll get rid of our oxygen. So there's, there's things that we need to keep these animals. They're designed good and, and genuinely, like I hope people will be cautious when they swim, like look around your surroundings uh, and, and be safe. You know, if the water's cloudy, eh, it might not be good to go out so deep just because a shark, if you can't see in the water, a shark might not be able to see you. So I have to ask, are you going to venture out into the ocean? I am. Uh, <laughs> my family has nicknamed me the Stanity because I'm kind of a big guy and I'm pasty white. <laughs> and so I'm hoping a shark will see me and say, hey, he's one of ours. <laughs> there you go. And you know what to do if you come in contact with one, right? Yeah, run. No. <laughs> I, mean, I can't run in the Swim water. Fast. Well, I don't say. Yeah. Keep it close to the shore. Stan, thanks so much. Don't be a stranger. We'll have him back in for another show and tell very soon.